All right, how you tubes? So welcome to a long overdue, uh, let's say, Fever 21 video. I must say I haven't made an upload for about a week or so, so quite a long time for me. Uh, but uh, right now we are within like the month of December, of course, and well, you know, well 12 now for you, uh, 12 to 12, 12 of December now for you, but 13 for me. And like I said, it's been about two weeks since I made my last video, which is probably back in December, uh, like, uh, probably November back then. But now, uh, you know, Christmas time, or well, upcoming Christmas, so uh, this is where we usually get footmas, but this year we don't, whereas we've got instead foot freeze players, which um, before we used to get three SBCs every day, and that was really exciting, but now we only get one, so, you know, everyone probably will get hyped on this one, but is doing then there's not much I can do. Uh, they just do like a little hint, a little leakage of who's coming up. So first player was uh, Marquinhos and then now it's Al Saudi and then there's gonna be a Brian Leverkusen player next tomorrow and then there will be uh, a Sp Spain striker which I don't really know but all of these position has been changed so just uh, there's really no clue of who this is gonna be but uh, we're gonna get a Spanish striker and then there's going to be a Manchester United player, which might be a little interest to me, if I be honest. But, uh, uh, but anyway, in this video, we'll do a few of SBCs. And I won't go through the uh, objectives and stuff like that. So SBCs that we'll do today would be the Tristan Asaudi, because um, good stamina and good pace, decent defending. That's good enough for me. Uh, five star weak foot, four star skill moves, uh, relatively tall, right footed, uh, slightly, I don't know, worried about high high, but uh, you know, as long as he's got good stamina, it should be okay, ADA, I think. Uh, he will run back and forth. Uh, if you're really struggling, just ask him to stay back, and it should be okay. Makino was another good card yesterday. Um, you know, play him as centre back, top class centre back. Um, but this one was an 86, was it? Yeah, 86 from yesterday. I might do that one. It got about three more days. Depends what plays I get, really. But uh, I'm surprised at that. Look, Marquinhos is here for three days. But this one, who just came out today, is here for two days. Kind of weird. And you also get the loan version as well, if you do want to. Um, there is the loan, Christian Saudi and Marquinhos here. Which, uh, like I said, yeah, it's kind of weird. But. Uh, the cheering mobile I wanted to do, but the fact that I've got so many strikers in that position, uh, he's a good value card, but of course he doesn't get upgraded, and nor does he really fit into the squad for me. Uh, I also do an update on the squad as well. Uh, we also do the freeze challenge number two, which I did do the one yesterday, but because uh, I kind of submitted it quickly, um, I didn't, I didn't uh, really record. I didn't get anything nice, so it was, um, the fact that it wasn't really worth uploading. That's why I didn't. Uh, didn't really do a video on it. Um, I just really haven't done much content because I've just been busy at work of late and then you know, kind of got really tired when, once I got back. And, um, you know, I found out we're not even that foot champ, so there's really not much to show, so that's why I've not really made much videos. But uh, we, we have been playing still, like Division Rivals and Squad Battle and stuff like that. So I didn't qualify for foot champ this weekend either. Um, let's do a quick update of the squad and then we'll quickly move on to the SBCs. Uh, it'll just be very quick. So this is the squad and I should ask the squad I'm doing the objective with. Uh, as you know, Icon Swap as well. Uh, like I said, I've missed a lot of updates. Uh, so we're trying to get through as much as we can in this video. So this is the uh, this is the new team that I've made uh, based on what we've got. A very upgradable team because all these are UEFA cards that are from SPCs. And now they're upgradable, so uh, I'm glad I got these. So, you know, this squad, which initially I set up as a backup squad, uh, kind of all of a sudden moved on to a main squad. So, uh, Felipe Anderson as well is really good value. Uh, Atal didn't get upgraded, so I'm an SBC man, I'll be very, very honest. So, the only, way, the only place I get players are from SBCs. Ronaldo, which he's amazing, we know that uh, you probably, if you did watch my previous videos, then you know how I got him. And then the you know, just to link in it. So I think this squad generally very Argentinian and you know, everyone's happy, everyone's on full cam. Uh, it's the only way I can link these two together. But again, I still really want a like a better centre back here to Adam Minatel, or maybe like an upgraded version of him. He's still good, but of course he's not world class, so I need a right back here and a right back. A centre back here and a right back here. 
basically uh, the two players I'll look to upgrade. And you know what? Let's do the FPC now. I thought you got it set up, so it should be nice and quick. Um, I'm actually gonna do the um, I'm gonna do the challenge first. I've got it set up. I'll show you quick. Got it set up. I just need one more chem point, which a position change will do it for me. Uh, if you've got enough, if you think that's enough, then uh, yeah. But anyway, uh, rare play. No, that's not the one. Um, there we go. Free challenge number two. Rare gold pack, which um, I don't know. So here, what you want to do is you want to use as many silvers as you can, which I went to um, you know silvers, Japan, and build support on there. Matt played from the same league, Max 5, so I assume most Japanese players are going to be from the Japanese league. And let's chuck them all in, because um, you know Japanese playing at Japanese league, they should get full chem. That gets you most of your chemistry, and then you shove some other players in just for some other linkage. So you can see there, my goalkeeper here doesn't even get any, you know, not really any linkage. So that's up to you. If you're struggling for chem, just put a Brazilian, I uh, put a, uh, sorry, put a... You know, I would just put a uh, proper, you know, proper England player here. Like, let's say, yeah, the one I showed you. Proper England centre back here should do the trick here. So, you know, if you're struggling for Kemp, and then you do need three goal players, which uh, it would be useful for. You do need as also need three players from one club. Which I went for Aston Villa, so this could also be where you start. So I did have to go buy Ollie Watkins, but it was like 900 coins, so that's fine. Grealish. It's not always worth much. He's tradable anyway. He's tradable. Yeah, people are picking these players. Like, you want to go for cheap gold players. Uh, Wesley, again, would be another cheap option. I don't think he's worth much anyway. So, about, about, yeah. Less than a K for these. So, just pay about 1K each for these. And then use silver that you have in your squad. So, 3K, that's done. Nice and easy. Um, that, like I said, if you are struggling with Cairns, pop, uh, pop uh, England centre back here. Yeah, pop England centre back here, and if you're still lacking Cam, put another England or, or uh, yeah, whichever league you've got, England goalkeeper, which I assume like silver shouldn't be too expensive. Just go for the common silver, and then your goals, you know, gonna be red gold. And of course, if you have common, like I say that, you know, way more Cam than we need it. So uh, you get the idea. Um, yeah, that's fine because I don't want to mess it up. So I'm just gonna submit this first to get our untradeable. Uh, what is this? Rest. Was that guy good? Sorry. Uh, this guy used to use as a silver player. Well, I miss him. Pop him there. I think what, that kind of works really nicely. I'll go for that then. You know. Um, actually, you know he's worth a little more. You know what? You get chance to sell some players as well. I mean, you know, if you've got lots of silver players, and as you know, people are going to be doing this as we see. So, you know, you've got some like common or rare silvers just lying around. Uh, I think I think that could be a, you know, right now could be a good time to use them. So, no, you know what? Let's go back with what I had. Uh, I'll go submit this. But uh, you know, like I said, you can go sell these players. Anything that you feel linked together. Uh, this guy, for example. If if they're not worth more than like one k, I'll probably just leave it. But, uh, Nah. There are lots of leagues you can go for. Oh, this guy isn't untradeable, but anyway. Uh, I assume this goalkeeper now have a little bit of value. Nope. It's 250, let's go buy one. So, we'll see, mate. Alright, so let's go submit. There's been one video too long. I, hope I am recording, by the way. Okay, good. I haven't been recording for a while. Um, hopefully, I'm getting new mic as well. So, Thompson can go, and then that Japanese guy can go. That's fine. So that's that one done. Uh, I tried to do it as cheap as possible. So 25k pack back, and then we'll open this, and then we'll do a Christian Asaidi, and then I'll just do a quick uh, foot icon swap. Like uh, I kind of missed out on that, so quickly do that. Rare gold pack, 12 rare golds of any item, of course, players or just any item. Of course, they're untradeable, which is not ideal, but uh, don't get a walk out here. Do we even get a? There we go. I think he's duplicate, so might need to chuck him into SBC. Just give me a set on that. Yeah, he's duplicate, so... Uh, that was an awful pack. 
He's untradeable. He is untradeable. Can I use him here straight away? So that's why I did this one first. French goalkeeper. Relatively hard to link, I would say. French goalkeeper. Is he link anywhere here? Not really. Let's get him for now. So like I said, I've got it set up already. Um, just depends. I, I don't get any packs back, so I can just probably, you know, continue with this. So I want to look for players that I can replace without dampening the chemistry, which is quite a tough task, I must say. Uh, and here you can use Team of the Weeks or Red players. That's up to you. Personally, I more prefer the uh, informs because right now they're so dead, um, utterly useless for me. So. Where red players I can go and do the upgrade later, so I thought I'll just rather chuck this in. Um, look, I really don't want to mess up any of the chemistry. Oh, that's fine. Look at that. That's already good to go. So I don't even need a chem swap. Uh, Coutois, who is in my first eleven, but um, I kind of need to use him here, and I probably overpaid for mine anyway. So yeah, I'll probably just buy another one if I need it later on. So. That's pretty good. I really need a right back, so two serial player. I've just got one extra, and then the team of the week player, and 85 squad, and then 68 chemistry. You see how I got my chemistry there. Uh, just one for players' prizes. Ibra I got for free. Uh, when it bought the Immobile for 28k, I'm on PC, just so bear that in mind. Um, you know, most of these are, I've got un untradeable, you know, Modric untradeable. A bus was actually packed as a tradable, but I'll use him here. Pepe, 750, Vatongan, very cheap. Like I said, the only player probably expanded like Coutoir, 52k, and then plus the Immobile, come on, do math, about 80k right now. 80k, uh, 80K plus um, bus was about 30 or 20, yeah, about, about 30k as well. That takes us to 110. And another 110, uh, sorry, another, yeah, another 30, so uh, you're looking at about 140 if you were to use this exact squad from scratch. So uh, personally, I would rather use a lower rated player here. Um, you know, let's just, just have a look in your squad, see what you've got. Um, you know, I'm sure you guys might have some other players, so just quick run through of what I've got here. Uh, of course, like not using these, uh, these are bought very expensively, and all these up the upgradable cards we're not going to use. And then apart from that, there's really not much. We're looking at the 85 lower ends, so and then we'll go straight to 83 either. So I think I would go submit this, although I would recommend not to use the Coutoir. Instead, you want to go for you know, like some, um, you go for some cheaper players, like low rated, but and then bring these 81s up as well. So maybe, um, you know, put De Gea here and then two other uh, La Liga center backs or something like that. That, that should, or Premier League center backs, perhaps, then should get the cam. But, um, uh, I'm lazy, so I'm just gonna go submit this. So I'm using untradeables as much as I can, uh, again. Bear in mind, there will be more SBCs coming, so don't don't go all in and all crazy on this. But for me, I'm lacking a right back, and I think this guy fits in really nicely. So I'm just gonna go something like this. So I will lose Coutoir, Modric, and that guy. Oh. I'm okay to use Coutoir here because uh, I do have a backup keeper, which still get full cam. I'm gonna use the Barcelona. What's his name? I forgot his name. Anyway, let's go something like this. And then he's gonna walk out for us, so a little overpriced for me, but I need it, so and there's not much option. So there's really not many right backs in this position. There's like Quadrado, uh that's pretty much it really. Quadrado Hakimi, that's it. I'm talking about playable right backs, so if they do uh, icon swaps, you know, if they had right backs, I would have wanted him as well. So that's my flashy first three at uh, foot suite. I say that. Foot freeze player SVZ that's completed uh, in this series, so hence I'm making a video. Um, there's not really much of another pack opening because we already opened our pack. Um, but yeah, like I said, five star, high high, great stamina. I'll show you how he fits into the squad, uh, and then that's pretty much it for the video. Um, 
it is an upgrade for me, so hence I'm doing it. So this is the other squad. So I'm gonna swap the goalkeeper for uh Neto, that's the one. I keep forgetting the name. So Neto, yeah, if I put Neto there, brings rain down, still get a chemistry. Why not? So he's decent as well. Of course could file probably better, but uh I'll give that a go. So that's the well, team two, that's that's why I call this team two. And this is the team I used to play my foot charm last weekend, so hence we didn't qualify. <laughs> but anyway, uh, we have Hakimi on 7 camps, that's why I wanted to upgrade here. Um, I have made some changes, you know, I, I, you rarely see a player play this guy as a centre back. Trust me, uh, I don't want it as well, so that's why I'd probably get uh, Vidic on, uh, on the icon swap. I know he's not very good, but... I guess it's a good option, at least I know who I'm getting. So I'm swapping 85 or 85. Alright, lose out on a bit of pace, well, quite a lot on pace. Lose out on shooting, which is fine. And then I'll be getting a lot better passing, same dribbling, better defending, which is very important as a right back. And then slightly better physical as well. So we're looking at it on the other way around. So yeah, only lose pace and, uh, and shooting. So give him a shadow. Yeah, no doubt it's going to be Shadow, so untradeable, uh, Shadow there, and then, you know, 97 pace, 97 screen speed, I think that's good enough for me, and you're looking at like 90 for inter 94 for interception, defensive awareness 89, which is slightly low, but, and then standing tackle, sliding tackle, with all these like maxed, almost maxed, so I think that's really good as a right back, so I think that's a good addition, good news is he's low rated as well, which kind of helps. And then I'll put Varane there later on as well. Um, can I actually reduce the range? Nope, not really. I'll keep, I'll keep it like this, which is um, fine. I'm uh, very comfortable attacking playing now. Yeah, that, that's the super subs. And then that's the squad for the, um, well, potentially for champ. I'll try this out. Uh, might do a review later if I got, let's say if I get 10 likes on the video, and then I'll do a review. Uh, actually, no, sorry, 10 comments. Comments not very harder, but 10 likes and then, uh, you know, just by, you know, basically by, I don't know, a week or so, 10 likes, I'll do a review on this Asali, but, uh, Asali, sorry, um, that's pretty much it. I still want to do the Marquinhos, but, um, still got time on that, so, uh, I'll probably do some squad battles and then, uh, oh yeah, I can swap. I just want to go through this real quick. Um, so you get the Palassi, you're not a big fan. So I can swap eight up for grabs, and then there's three here. So there's total 11 you can get. And then I'll show you which ones I can do. So this one I'll do Premier League, six games. A lot of rage quit, I tell you what. I've played in the league already. I had about two rage quits already. Score two goals, rage quit. One goal, rage quit. Quite nice. I reckon you do that as well. That's nice. So if we all do that, that'll be nice. Rage quit after a few games. And then, so Premier League will do, Serie A will do, and the League will do, Bundesliga will do, League 1 will do, and then do the, these you can do as you go along, so score in 30, should be fine, yeah, if, you know, you can either rage quit or you can just play amongst yourselves, score 30 goals each, well, probably, probably fit 10 or 20 in, usually about 20 max, I think. But anyway, so yeah, all these 8 I'm happy to get, and then here I'm just going to scrap these, because, Five squad battle, eleven players will be certainly very boring. I'm not gonna do them. So eight icon swap tokens for me and initially. And then uh, I'll do quick uh, quick um, like who I, who I will likely to get. Uh, we got uh, sorry swaps. And this this year doing more on pack, so you're gonna need more luck, kind of thing, more of a gamble, which uh, First, initially I thought Ronald Koeman could be a good card, but uh, I reckon he's more suited as a CDM because of the high medium work. I probably don't want to play him a centre back. He'll just go up too many times. Start from front. Terry Henry would be your top choice, but I reckon you will need. I just thought usually twenty icon swap up for grab. So even if I didn't do the free squad battle. I can still potentially get this Terry on read. There will be SBC as well. Um, base icon pick, not a big fan of that. Uh, mid icon, that could be good, you know, if you uh, 
Again, you're gambling, but that, that could be a good one. Bit in Prime. I reckon Prime probably more worth it to be honest. Cheaper, less less swaps, and you know, I, I personally don't like this one. Like mid icon, 89 rated, who cares? But mid or prime, again, worth a gamble, I guess. Uh, Ratchet, right card, there we go, right card. Uh, you can get him as well. He doesn't normally look that good, that's why I don't I don't like this card usually. Crewman already went through, mid icon, 12 token if you want. Uh, I'm not sure who this guy is actually. <laughs> Croatian player. I, so I really don't know, so I'm not going to comment. Uh, good, looks like a decent striker if you do need a striker, but I've got CL7, I don't need him. Uh, base, mid icon, again, worth a gamble if you want 10 tokens. Haji, uh, decent, and then links, well, not really a linkable player, but uh, uh, you know, playing some cam should be okay. Base icon, you're looking at minimum 8, so. And this is, I think, uh, is this the base for yeah this is base so I'm not sure I think this is the base version base village uh, as a man you fan <laughs> I like the look of him uh, probably give him a shadow and then you know, 80 85 acceleration 89 spring speed which center back right now could be okay so I keep I forgot he went to Inter uh, but anyway uh, yeah, so Village would be my top choice. That's seven. And I'll gamble on. I'll probably do this one. Because if I want to do. Um, I only have eight. But if I get the other half as well. Depends what else comes out. But um, one of these two I'll link it with. So uh, let's say if I do the eight initially, get the Village. And then I'll have one spare. And then if we do like four more, I can get this one. I might just even go for this, two ultimate packs. You know. Uh, yeah, all these are good. So I'll probably do village and then mix it up with one of these. Depends how much time I can spend on this. Of course, this one ideal, but if not, I'll go for this. Or if not, even worse, go for this. So up to you. Again, they're all untradeable, but you know, save those for a team of season. Uh, can we go wrong? I think. Uh, so anyway, I'm gonna have to end the video here. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, like I said, I will be trying out those players and trying to list these out. I, I reckon informs might go up a little bit as well. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you're new to here, make sure you subscribe, hit the like button if you did enjoy the video. Um, let me know what you think of free so much uh, so far. I don't know. Anyway, uh, next video probably be squad battle if I do get something nice if I, I won't upload if it's not been nice but uh, and then Thursday uh, just a foot champ sorry just uh, division rivals so probably you have to wait till next Thursday until a big video but of course there are more, more content coming from uh, these freeze FBC so uh, I hope to upload daily but I cannot promise anything if there's anything that I feel like worth doing uh, I'll, I'll upload of course but um yeah hope, grateful of your support so as always thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye for now